Hello everyone, I wanted to do a video with angels and here we have a beautiful angel and I would like to do a video on communicating with your angels. So connecting with your angels is very simple. You don't need cards, you don't need anything. You just sit in silence and you just start talking out loud or in your mind and just ask for assistance and breathing nice and slow, getting your body relaxed, and ask questions. And the best time to do this is any time, really. But if you want to, before you go to bed, ask a question to your angels. And um, I want to say angel. So you're born with an angel. And you can call on different angels for different assistance, okay? For love, for strength, for protection. So you can definitely work with the angels if you will. There's many different uh, beings, entities that are there to help guide us through our life. So we are using the um, Healing with the Angel card. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to shuffle. All right. And what you want to do... And two cards fell out. Actually, four cards fell out. So I'm going to use these, okay? So communicate with your angel. So I didn't even ask a question. And these four cards just fell out, okay? So we have surrender and release. Then we have balance. And we have focus and new beginnings, okay? So these four cards just came out as I was shuffling, <laughs> and it and uh, I believe that it has a message for someone out there. So if you're watching this video, it is definitely calling out to you. It's saying to surrender and release, and that is very important when you're going through anything is to release it and. I'm very much into numerology, and four popped out, so discipline, order, devotion. So maybe someone out there feels the need that they need to bring more discipline into their life, to bring some order, okay? So you want that balance, and then balance comes after that, okay? Four is an even number. It offers balance, right? So it all matches up. And when you when you are balanced, you get more focused, right? And then the new beginning card is here. And of course, you can start anew and feel like you you are on the right track. So we have a surrender and release. And I just think working with the angels is very powerful, very very powerful. It's amazing. And I have I have these cards for years. I got. Um, a friend of mine in another state where I used to live, she had a beautiful shop and she uh, was my Reiki master. She's a Reiki master and she was also an angel uh, therapist. And she got her training from a lady that uh, received her training through Doreen Virtue. And I, at that point, this is back in 2002, I, um, I'm not sure if I knew of her but I got these cards, and I've had these cards for years, and I I actually started, this is one of my first cards I started my readings with back in 2000, 2000, well, 2002, I believe I got these cards, I'm not sure, but um, I started with other cards, card reading, in 2000, so it's been a while, but I really like the oracle cards, I do like the traditional um, tarot cards, but I also do love the oracle cards, and uh, I'll do another video on that, but um, it's all the energy and the messages you receive. It's just different forms of receiving messages and guidance throughout our life. So these four cards popped out, so I, I hope um, in communicating with your angels, if you've never spoke to your angels before, maybe this card is saying now is the time to surrender. So I love this picture. It, it really shows that heavy jar and letting the water release. 
and the weight is like off your shoulders. You're not carrying that burden anymore. So definitely communicate with your angels and um, leave, leave a message here. Maybe tonight will be your first night if you haven't, or maybe you have before, and you're going to start back up speaking to your angels. So uh, let me know if this helps. Please leave comments. I would appreciate it. Thank you so much. Namaste.